the Oracle LTrim function. The LTrim function removes all characters that you specify from the left side of a string. It's often used to remove space characters, but because you can specify the character you want to remove, you can remove a lot of other characters. It's similar to the trim and rtrim functions. The syntax of ltrim is shown here. The first parameter is the input string, and it's a string that you want the characters removed from. The second parameter is the trim character. It's optional, and it's a value that you want to remove from the input string. If you don't specify it, it uses a space character. Let's take a look at some examples. The first example here of the ltrim function has some space characters and then the word database star. You can see it's removed the spaces from the left of the value here. The second example here has some underscores to the left of database star. But in the second parameter, we're going to specify the underscore here as the character to remove. You can see in the output that it has successfully removed the underscores. The third example has a series of semicolons and spaces, and then the word database star. Then in the second parameter, we've specified a space, a semicolon, and a space. If we run this command here, we can see that those characters have been removed from the string. This is because the space and the semicolon characters were specified. The fourth example here is where we're selecting the country and then performing an ltrim function on the country. We've specified the character to remove as a capital U. You can see here that we have our original country value in the first column. And then in the second column, we have the LTRIM version of the country. So it's removed the U from USA and the U from UK, but left Canada and France untouched. Next, we're going to select an address field, but we're going to remove the number one. You can see here that there are several addresses that start with the number one and they have had the value removed from the left hand side. This example here removes a number value from the left hand side of a string, even though the string is inside quotes. You can see the zero has been successfully removed. This example here shows you how to use the LTrim and RTrim functions. We're going to remove underscores from both the left and the right side of a particular string. You can see the underscores have been removed. Now finally, we've put in some special characters, which is an E with an accent on top into the string, and we're going to try and remove it. You can see the characters have been removed successfully. So that's how you use the LTrim function.